The recent immigration bill did contain some provisions which uh, would have caused complications, but by and large I think those uh, difficulties have been removed as a result of the final reading of the bill. And on the whole I would say that now it emerges in a far more satisfactory state of would you say that uh, immigrants in this country have nothing to worry about at this point? I mean, what about the issues of black men and so forth? What no, would I, you say to them? About? I wouldn't say that they have nothing to worry about. They have plenty of problems. And uh, these problems are being attended to. The embassy is doing its best, and we from Pakistan are trying to assist. But uh, I uh, admit that they have a host of problems. However, talking about their legal status, the legal position in this country, that to a great extent now has been satisfactorily resolved. Other problems are there and we will try and tackle them. Now it's just been a uh, uh, President Bhutto at one of your biggest problems, the problem of the prisoners of war. Is there likely soon to be a settlement here, do you think? I think this is a question you should address to India. The prisoners of war are in their custody and we have made every sincere effort. We have taken many initiatives to try and resolve this human problem. It's a, uh, the question which affects international law, the Geneva Conventions, the resolutions of the United Nations, but so far we haven't succeeded. But what exactly is who can do to help in this matter? Did you discuss it with Mr. Heath, for example, today? Uh, uh, we had some useful discussions uh, with uh, uh, Mr. Heath. Britain can do a great deal. Uh, in the first place, Mr. Mujib Rahman claims that he is uh, very fond of the British and so are we, but Mr. Mr. Mujib Rahman says he wants to model himself on Mr. Harold Wilson's style of leadership. I, don't, I think one Mr. Harold Wilson is more than enough, but Mr. Mujib Rahman uh, has expressed great admiration for the British. We have association with the British and I am sure that uh, Britain can do a great deal to assist in this humanitarian problem. It is reported, uh, President, that in fact the other day you said you hated the British. Uh, what's the substance That's not that? correct. I never said that. I said there's a love-hate relationship which has existed over the centuries. How much of a